Hello all, this video is on dual RS-232 converter made by Japas Engineering to debug the uh, DWIN displays. This uh, uh, dual RS-232 converter has got two RS-232 female connectors and in between the connectors uh, TTL pins are extended. So you can connect one end to a PC using RS-232 to USB cable or you can use the TX or X pins to connect with microcontroller like Arduino. For a sample project, we have this 7 inch display 80480C0715WTR with the 8 MB flash. It has got RS232 connectors T2 and R2 are at the RS232 level and SD code socket is there to load the file. We will be using male RS232 D pin to connect with the, uh, this dual uh, DB9 connector. This dual DB9 connector has also got TTL pins so that you can connect with Arduino. One end is connected to PC using RS232 to USB cable, other end is connected to DB9 display. Now let us start the DGS software and a sample project to display DHT11 data onto DB9 display. For first create the ICL files for the background images. Here it is 23.ICL as the flash memory is only 8 MB and then also create the icon file at 32.ICL and then create data variables for uh, humidity VP address is 5000 and uh, temperature VP address is 5200 and variable icon uh, VP address let us uh, assign 5500 note on this VP address against this VP address only, we will be sending the data. And over this variable icon, we have to create for touch incremental adjustment. And then for CFG edit file, you have to touch sensitive enable, you have to make it auto. And then ICL address is 23 as it is 8 MB flash. And then store the CFG file as TFL CFG. And copy the dvin underscore set folder and use SD code method to load the project onto dvin display. The blue screen indicates that the project is being loaded. Reset the power, removing the SD card. Now the project is on to the dvin display. Now let us close the back cover of the display and then do the connection RS232 connection. This is DB9 mail connector. That is pin 2 is RXD which goes to R2 of display. Pin 5 is uh, TXD which goes to T2. Note the connection is straight. RX to RX, TX to TX. It is not reverse. RXD to R2, TXD to T2 and ground to ground. This is uh, DWIN side connection. The other side uh, we are using RS232 USB cable to connect to the PC. So this connection is simple and uh, we have to do some looping. For power of this DB9 connector, we are using Arduino, you know, 5 volt and ground. Here the looping is TX1 to RX2, TX2 to RX1. This looping is important. And then 5 volt and ground we take from Arduino. The board needs power that is taken from the Arduino, you know. This is the connection looping RX2 to TX1, TX2 to RX1. And ground and 5 volt from Arduino. So we are not uh, using Arduino for any other purpose only for powering up the other end is connected to rs232 usb which is connected to pc now from the project d dwin dgas software click on show debug another uh, window will open now open the serial uh, connect uh, serial com port that is also allotted to rs232 to usb and the baud rate is 115200 click on write vp so we are going to write to VP address 5000 and 5200. So in the debug window, uh, click on write VP and then uh, note the enter the VP address as 5000 and value in word that is in two bytes 00, zero and then uh, one zero that is in hex it is one six. So you click on send, you will get the data. 16. Same way for uh, change the VP address to 5200 and then send a uh, data that is uh, five digit 5 
you click on send it will be displayed on the dvin display so from uh, the pc to dvin it is working and also we can check the uh, touch uh, uh, variable icon at 5500 bp so uh, here you click on read when you touch on the uh, icon it will change from 0 to 1 so this is read and write so you can as well uh, read the vp address that is 5500 vp address as well as write the vp address both way communication is possible and you can see the hex data on the window now this is the Arduino Uno connection uh, uh, that is for DHT11 uh, sensor we are connecting to Arduino Uno and then the looping we are removing and then connecting so RX to RX and then TX to TX we are using software serial for the uh, Arduino Uno as usual the first uh, side that is the male uh, db connector that is also t2 to tx r2 to rx ground to ground looping we are removing and then uh, tx1 to tx rx1 to rx ground and uh, 5 volt from Arduino. you know uh, since we are using software serial uh, we are shifting the pins to 3 and 4 3 is rx 4 is uh, uh, tx that comes to rx and uh, tx straight connection it is not reverse and then dst11 is connected to data pin this is the code uh, dst11 pin is assigned and then we assign array of data to change the values of the, the vp address that is at 5000 we vp address we write humidity value and 5200 we write the temperature value Power for this uh, DB9 connector is taken from Arduino you know, 5 volt on ground and then DHT11 data pin is connected to Arduino. Now you can see the uh, values displayed on uh, uh, DB9 display, humidity and temperature value. So this DB9 dual connector is very easy to debug the project of uh, DB9 display. Thank you for watching.